Hey guys, it's Roy with Heath Massey Track and Trail. Uh, I just want to talk to you a, a little bit about some of the, the billet uh, head stuff that we have going on right now. We offer a couple different models. We offer for the Polaris XCR. We offer for the Skidoo uh, 809 and 780 base. And then obviously our, our thousand stuff, our bigger stuff. Um, <clears throat> Some of the advantages uh, to it are obviously, uh, you know, the strength and dexterity with the billet aluminum. Um, the biggest thing with the Polaris is obviously them being a three individual cylinder head model. Uh, being able to add that one piece head to it is right off the bat, just gonna add some strength to that motor twisting and wanting to do its natural thing when that crank's rotating at a high RPM. But uh, the biggest advantage is gonna be these domes right here. So these are the Ian Tomasi TNT power domes. And uh, this is what we would call a, a rough cut blank for us. Um, what we're able to then do is try a whole bunch of different combinations to make sure that uh, this style of dome is right for the motor. Uh, we've been playing around, we've been doing a ton of R&D and uh, I think we've settled on, on something that we are very happy with and we know that that makes power, especially on some of the stuff and the projects that we've been working on. Um, you know, we've done all kinds of R&D and, you know, try different squish bands, try different combustion chamber pocket styles. And, and this is something that we've, we've kind of settled on. Um, you know, this is a proprietary pocket shape to us. We've made up some tooling that has allowed us to uh, cut these pockets to our desired uh, shape and style and uh, it's what it, it's what works for us so we're, we're definitely happy with them and uh, another major advantage also um, with having these one piece billet heads is the torque uh, torque arms are built right into the billet aluminum just adding more to that strength and that dexterity and uh, having that motor not want to twist and and really do anything funky in that chassis. Uh, if you guys that like these little tech videos, we're gonna try and do them a little bit more frequently. Um, if it's something that you're interested, let us know in the comments. If there's specific topics, we'll see if we're able to cover that. And if you like the videos, uh, you know, we appreciate that and give us a like. Thanks.